I am posting this message, leaving in some of the personal references made, as they are helpful to frame context, which can assist everyone. On to the message. To date it is seen many around you who have not done well. In and of this is true, yet beyond all of it lies those things that we reserve to call treacherous features of living. As we move forward, these are encountered and we say when you do, be sure to invoke the necessary help within, to make it through. You have seen much in your time, and of that many things did adhere to precepts long ago. As this is the case here, determined efforts always survive that which is essential to do. Besides that, when determined efforts are met with strength of conviction, all falls apart far less frequently. As it is now, to date all things come forward have not harmed in the least, at least we think so. To you however, there may be other thoughts around on that. However, it is essential to grasp the concept being imported here. You are determined and with this much comes from it. Determined or not does not count as much as does sincerity of purpose. Here we have the meat of the matter. When sincerity of purpose is met hands down, with sincerity of pridefulness at what is being done, there is no escape for that put forth to you. It must emerge and grant its favors to you. Insistent or not, it is up to you to command and demonstrate this phenomena for yourself. It is of no good to visualize or practice wholeheartedly without organizing a purpose beneath it all. It just doesn't work. And this being said, let us continue, for until this is done there are aspects of being left undone, to hang out to dry so to speak, until that time when all is called forward and met with, sincerely and directly, to the point. Without that, little can come from any attempt to provide a better outcome for yourself or others as it is seen the lack or detriment incurred from not facing, or ill-advising, sanctions of personhood put forth around them. This however bends the rules some as all are not equipped to handle such fuss about self, seen here as attributes to freedom. So we tell you this in advance of seeing those things in the works to distribute their fate among men here on planet Earth. It is of little concern to judge or testify to the fact that this has occurred at all, yet beyond all considerations of being met with it, we see alternative means of behavior as available to all who inquire to it, lest of all those whose sole import continues to expand far out among the reaches of time and space itself. There you have it. Complete and uninterrupted. 